Create an animation blueprint called ABP Zombie. Open this animation blueprint and then open the event graph. Implement the initial animation blueprint event. You strike get pawn owner to get the zombie and cast it to BP zombie. Promote the zombie to variable. In the update animation section validate the zombie. If the zombie is valid, use get velocity of the zombie and get the vector length by xy and promote it to variable named speed. And select the nodes for speed calculations and collapse them. Rename the collapse nodes to get speed. Open the collapse nodes and call the output. Open BP enemy and make his melee attack public. Then go back to animation blueprint, open event graph and find update animation. And get his melee attack of zombie. Promote it to variable. Open the animation graph and add a state machine called motion. Open the state machine, add a movement state and connect it to entry. Create a state named melee attack. Add the transitions from movement to melee attack. And add transitions from movement to melee attack and back to movement from this state. Open movement and add zombie movement blend space. And set the speed to the speed pin. In the melee attack state add the zombie attack animation as pose. Now let's add conditions for transitions. For the transition from movement to attack, set it to is melee attack. For the transition from attack to movement, tick automatic rule based on sequence player in state. Then open the animation graph root and connect motion with the output poles. Create a folder for AI in the blueprints folder. and create an AI controller called AI Zombie. Next create behavior tree named BT Zombie. Open it and create new blackboard called BB Zombie. In the AI controller, in the begin play event, call run behavior tree and select BT zombie. 